name is Bliss, um, and I'm with I Am The Generation, we're a YouTube ministry, um, so feel free to check it out. I'm going to be up here and keep it short, <laughs> keep it simple, but um, I really just want to encourage you guys. I know this is club worship and it's exciting about what everything God has done for us, but sometimes we have to fight to get into that presence and get into that place. Yeah. So this is kind of a little bit about that. But, um, so I'm just going to go ahead. God. Don't you see, don't you hear, don't you know that this is a cry from a heart that longs to know you. My soul needs to rediscover you. I come knowing what I am, knowing I'm unworthy, knowing that I had allowed them to damage me, I admit. I took the steering wheel, and while everything was going smoothly, doing everything that you had taught me, out of my peripheral, it hit me. Something had crossed my pathway. He came out of nowhere like he had been waiting all day. He came full force, full speed, never pumping the brakes or stopping to heed. The initial hit took us both flying off the road. We flipped a couple of times and it was a straight free fall. Off a cliff from that mountain I was climbing, all we could do was just fall. He screamed from the other side that we'd make it out okay, that somehow this was a good thing and reassured he would stay. Holding on, trying to save what I could, we crash landed and on top of me he stood. The first encounter only shocked me. I mean, I had kind of enjoyed the fall, but when it was all over, I was shattered underneath the pressure of it all. Didn't even call for help or try to revive, not really concerned if I'd make it out alive. Instead, just blame me for being in the way and wish me a good day. Somehow I got up, but I still feel broken. Still feel blood pouring out somewhere I'm open. Somewhere this wound runs deeper than me, keeps going farther than I can see. Keeps seeping into every generation behind me, seeping into everything that defines me. Finding out everything he couldn't do and who he really was, realizing who she wasn't and everything she really does. Falsely defined by inherited issues, broken down by uncovered news. I grew up with evil's presence, but its identity was not known. <sighs> I mistook my parents' demons for my own. But now this letter is addressed to him. Him whose promises were paper thin, look. Look at Satan, how pretty your mask could be. Look how close your lies got to me. Look at the church in their white shirts. The more I think about my scarlet stains, the more it hurts. The more I pray for a better future, the more my past replays all my days. Was this how you planned it to end? What did you intend when you walked into my life with a deceptive twinkle in your eye, providing an intricate fabrication of love where everything except my heart could lie? Was that all your efforts to make sure my life would end up a lie? To make sure that all I had become and had hoped for would surely die? But my faith is still alive, and with tenacity I will hold on to the hour my Savior will arrive. You know, this started out as a redemptive plea cry, but my God turns his prayer into a war cry. Take all that's around me, but the kingdom is inside me. Take all that I have, pray to poverty, but you cannot have me. I might have been tossed around a little bit, broken and torn down a little bit. You think that because you got me alone with you in this pit that my salvation was what you were going to get? Understand, I stepped into this ring on purpose to fight you. That's what I declared the day I received grace and was found true. The day Jesus broke the chains and I renounced you. After all you've done, I'm coming after you. You know, if my God can conquer hell, death, and the grave, then I will surely be fearless, mighty, and brave. Make music without singing, do the impossible when I'm not dreaming. With purpose awake every day, hit my knees and pray. My spirit arise and on guard pose, fighting battles nobody knows. And against this world, I will rebel, and all my days wage war on hell. And I ain't stopping until that bell rings, because I ain't going home till that trumpet sings. And now that I know what you look like, I'm coming after you. And trust, you're going to know me too.